the thing with the graffiti in Wimbledon is there's so much amazing artwork down there that you can't see all of it in one like two hour tour or three hour tour or four hour tour even there's just it's just way too much what we try to do is we try to hit on some of the major locations um, show a variety of different artists local and international and the Wynwood district has kind of become um, a mecca for graffiti artists and muralists from all over the world and truly really exploded in the past couple of years So what we do is we take people around on scooters, leave from Miami Beach, take them across the Venetian Causeway, uh, wind up through the Wynwood Art District. We stop at about a half a dozen different places, kind of talk in depth about the history of graffiti, um, the history of art in Miami, you know, and the way it's really grown in the past few years. Um, kind of introduce them to the different local crews and show them some of the international artists that, uh, that are featured all over the walls down there. And just kind of talk about how things are growing and changing in the art scene down here. Graffiti traditionally has, has primarily been illegal. You know, most of the graffiti you'd see in most cities is illegal. People throw it up at night in the dark, whatever. Um, but it's evolved into such an art form that in Miami now there's a lot of walls that are actually legal. Illegal walls you don't see as much down here as you used to because so much of it has become, you know, legitimate. I think it's such a fascinating art form because it's always changing. You know, it's not, it's not something you're going to see on the wall of the Met in a hundred years. It's, you know, you see it and you're lucky and it's gone. Especially here where we have Art Basel every year. So every year, you're lucky if peace lasts a year, you know, because it's going to get redone. You know, the walls are coveted and people want to get, get new work up there for the people that are coming into town. So it's rare you see something that lasts a long time and I really love the way that that happens.